Hey everyone, it's your favorite pastry, and welcome back to my playthrough of Fall of 4, You Only Live Once. Last time, we rescued some hostages, and now they're just kind of meandering about. With the assistance of Jake, the stranger that we finally learned her name. And today, we're going to go to uh, Olivia and grab a few things for Jake. But first, Jake mentioned something about going to Drumlin Diner to pick up some supplies. Which I think we'll head to. Hopefully the... Mr. Handy isn't there. Sorry, not Mr. Handy. Lieutenant Gusty. Is that right? Lieutenant Gutsy. That's it. Hopefully it's a little bit safer there. Let's see what these settlers have to say. Hi, how are you? Yeah. I just want to trade a few things. Absolutely nothing. Old Paul, do you have anything? Just wanted to trade a few things. What is it? All right, we're approaching the diner right now. Or at least where Trash Can Carlo was. Hopefully we won't see any myth Lieutenant Gutsy. Okay, looks like we're good for the Lieutenant Gutsy. We had a deal, Trudy. Guns away. And charisma gear on. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? He bought them fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Whoa, whoa. Easy there, Scab. This doesn't involve you. Looks like you got some trouble. I could help. Help? What are you, some kind of hired gun? If I help, I... All right. I was going to pay you a hundred. I'll talk to her. Maybe we can work this out. I appreciate it. If things go sideways... All right, that went well. He didn't shoot me. It's always good when I'm not getting shot at. Hey there. I saw you in that poison cellar talking. Well, he ain't getting his money. Period. Look, you owe them money. If you just pay them, then this will be over. Everyone walks away without getting hurt. All right, I'll pay. But that bastard ain't gonna sell one more drop of jet to my boy. You hear that, Wolfgang? You'll get your damn money. But I better not catch you selling chems to my boy again. Fine by me, Trudy. Your son's broke as shit anyhow. All right. Crisis is over. If you're here to trade, step up to the counter. There we go. <clears throat> we get paid and I don't even gotta shoot nobody. Good job. Here. Now how about I show you all the pick me up? I don't need anything. Yes, I wanted to end things peacefully because Wolfgang and Simone here uh, help prevent uh, random encounters from spawning. They kind of act as guards. For helping us out with Trudy. You did good. Which makes this place We're open for business again. a little bit safer. A little lighter in the pocket, thanks. Let's see what you have. All salvage, but nothing's junk. There we go. The thing I wanted to get. The suppressed pipe pistol. Or pipe old acting pistol. It's a guaranteed suppressed weapon. I'll be taking that. Thank you very much. 
Ooh, and what do we have here? All right, I'm selling her two pieces of Raider gear, five stain packs, and I'm buying a pipe bolt action pistol with the suppressor. Excellent. Since we're done shopping, we're going to put on our gear again and not go walking around without our armor. I'm totally going to make that mistake. And now we're just going to head back to Red Rocket and I'm going to swap some things around. I'll see you there. Hopefully the journey there is quiet again. And would you look at that. The journey back to Red Rocket was quiet indeed. My favorite keyword. Now that I say that, there's totally going to be like three super moons just around the corner. There we go, take that off. And boom. A suppressed pipe bolt action sniper rifle. Now I can get rid of this thing. And get rid of my extra bits of junk. And you know, all I'm here. There we go. Do I have anything to cut? Right, I have some grilled rat roaches. Ooh, and iguana. And still more. Alright. Iguana on a stick is particularly great because one iguana on stick is one unit of hunger. I'm not going to have one right now. Instead, I'm going to have the grilled rad roach. And some water. Now we can head to Olivia. But first, we're going to hit Jake's little supply cache. I'll see you there. Hopefully nothing exciting happens. Alright, another uneventful journey. And wouldn't you know it, I leveled up. I discovered thick excavations on my way here. Which was enough experience to push me over the edge. Now, what do I need? Even though a bonus 20% damage to rifle sounds nice, I think I'm going to go with 20% damage to my pistol. Yeah. Hopefully I don't regret that decision. Hold on, we're near the cache. Just give me a second here. I hid this stuff a while back when I first checked out the area. Aha! Looks like it's all still here. How do you like the headwear? Pretty cunning, don't you think? You look absolutely fabulous. Well, I know it's a flattering color, but fabulous? Kind of feel bad with what you're stuck with now. 
Here, this is for you. Oh, stim packs. Just what I needed. I don't think so. I like my hat, just the way it is. Oh yeah, I also put this on my heart pock bar. And only 37 shots. I feel like I should have grabbed some ammo on the way here. Or when I bought it, the suppressed pipe pistol. Now, let's see. There, sh there they are. Oh, oh that's danger. We're gonna run. Because wouldn't you believe it, blowflies are one of the most dangerous enemies in the commonwealth. Crab rat. That's new. What's a scrap rat? That was not part of the plan. Not even remotely close. Are they scavengers? And the scrap rat is their leader? That does make some semblance of sense. Oh, it looks like they're heading to the blowfly. Maybe they can take care of it for me. Really? I gu guess I did shoot at his friend. Well, he can join him now. We just started and I'm already stressed out. Blowflies are unironically one of the harder enemies in the game, or one of the more dangerous, at least on YOLO. They bounce around a lot, and their stainers do a surprising amount of damage. Wait up! I'm gonna hold back, scout the area for nasty. I'll let you deal with the raiders directly outside Olivia. Once you're done taking out the trash, I'll meet you at station's entrance. There are supposed to be raiders. Particularly one right there, but I'm not seeing him. They're coming back. Why are they coming back? Well, here's something interesting. 
for raiders and they're not showing up as hostile. Well, it looks like the raiders are taking care of this my scavenger problem. So I think those raiders are part of the mod. Later when we're inside, we're ambushed by another set of raiders. And I think those scavengers just took care of them for me. Oh boy, they barely took any damage. Hmm. How am I going to do this? I think I have just the idea. Up here we have a friend. In the form of a sentry bot. Now when I activate him, a bunch of mole rats will come out and ambush us. But that shouldn't be too bad. I say that. I'm probably going to take a massive hit. Because the uh, sentry bot can take care of them quite well, and we can all enough jump on a bunch of cars to avoid them, the mole rats from jumping out right underneath of us. Oh yeah, mole rats can burrow, and they like to jump out right in front of you, and when they jump out they do a little bit of damage. Just gonna wait for these guys to pass by. There we go. I think we should be relatively safe. Ooh, well did Raiders just beast. Lightweight. I'm gonna take that. Thank you very much. There we go. I think we're safe from the scavengers for the time being. Switch back my 10mm pistol. Good. The sentry bot is still there. Boot him up. Okay, good. He's still friendly. There's Jake. He's gonna monologue for a bit. Yes. Yes. Later on, when I get the penetrator perk, I'll be able to hit these fusion cores. I don't want to right now. Because he's big and scary and he'll probably one-shot me. And he's a bit of a friend right now.
Any minute with the mole rats. I'm glad he only has machine guns. Okay. Got a fair bit of leather and hopefully meat and bones. Excellent. That went exactly as I wanted it to go. Now. Did I get the magazine in here? I did get the magazine in here. Now this guy will just go right onto Olivia. But he's kind of slow because his fusion cores overheat when he's walking. He can patrol around here as much as he wants, but as soon as he walks five feet from here, he starts overheating. No clue why. Oh, more raiders. Just gonna give you gentlemen a wide berth. I think I'm hearing gunshots. You know, I'm starting to think that all of the raiders are dead. But I still need to be careful because someone decided to strap mines to a mole rat. Check which grenades I have set. Uh, fragmentation grenades, that will do fine. Hey there. Good job. You really don't like raiders, do you? There were a few lookouts around the perimeter, but I took care of them. Shouldn't have to worry about anyone raising the alarm. At least, not right now. Say, before we head in, would you care for a bit of advice? Sure. What's up? This particular raider group packs a little more artillery than the usual riffraff. And that includes some nasty big miniguns. Just remember, many guns need a few seconds to warm up before they start firing, so make sure you use that to your advantage. 
and make sure you get your ass behind some damn cover. You can't get hit by what can't see you. Thanks. I always appreciate good advice. Come on, let's head on in. Okay, looks like everyone was already dead. That made my life a little bit easier. I'm not going to inspect the tower because I don't want to accidentally trigger mole rats. Can't you tell I'm absolutely terrified of mole rats? That are rat scorpions. Oh, sweet mother of mercy, Jackson. Jake, don't do that. I thought he was a raider. Now, usually, either a dog or a raider walks by here. From Concord Hardware, delivery by Boston Direct, courtesy of Sender K.S. Magnuson, item one industrial sized Robco Com Hub unit. Com Hub. That must be the ACM equipment we're here for. And I think it's stored behind that door up ahead, which is locked. Huh. Recently tampered. It's an extra level of security. Now I reckon I can get through it though. Just give me a few minutes. In the meantime, I'd appreciate if you take care of any raiders around. I don't like the idea of someone sneaking up on us while I work on this. Be very quiet because I'm gonna be. We all saw that, right? The raider just disappeared. What? Of course, I had to miss. Just gonna hide here for a bit. Only a fucking coward hides. Yes, well the cowardly strategy will make sure I live. I'm glad they're very talkative because I know now know that Akak isn't on my descent. No sign of him now. And all this stress is making me a little hungry. Just take care of that really quick. I think that should be all of them on this level. I think it's just the two and the dog. 
downstairs, on the other hand. Oh, downstairs. That one's going to be a lot trickier. Pull up my silenced gun. Because there's that guy. And then three or four more. One of them being Akak. I'm glad body shots are one shot these guys. Reload really quick like. Oh, this takes six rounds per magazine. Good to know. Also, teddy bear with army helmet. Oh, I didn't want to take the teddy bear. Overdue book. I'll need an overdue book later on. Cigarette carton, since I'm always running out of asbestos. And fragmentation grenades are selected. They have Molotovs. But I have a grenade. Here, have a grenade. I was incredibly lucky there. They threw a Molotov. They somehow missed. When you turn up, you're dead. <laughs> what a little bitch. What good news is, I think I got rid of Akak. Akak. Akak? Akak. I almost saw, shot Jake. I don't think he would have taken too kindly for that. Glad I don't have an itchy trigger finger. Now there's a problem. I have no clue what this, this raider is. Okay, he's off to my right somewhere. And knowing the AI, yep. God damn it. He took the minigun. Ah, oh, thank you, spirits. Hey, so if you go up here. Jake will be in a bit of a firefight. But gotta be really careful. Never mind. Jake just took some out for me. Unless there's one right around the corner. And they didn't even trigger the mine. How rude. Hey. Mighty impressive. Thanks for the help. I was not enjoying the shootout developing there. No problem. Glad to be of service. Oh, dang it. Dent in my helmet. Oh, well, better than a bullet to the brain box. All right, let's get down to business. Yes. Down to business. 
Now down here is the locket that the Abernathy's want me to grab. And a bunch of junk that I'm just going to randomly grab. Lock it. Bobbin. Ooh. Duct tape. I always need more duct tape. And in here are a bunch of rad roaches. Got it. Trigger them. Wait for the fire to settle down. Is that all of them? I think that was all of them. Now, were any of you legendary? And I gotta be really careful because there's some rat barrels right real close by. Real close by. Wow, English pastry. And would you look at that? Not a single legendary so far. There is one more. And he was not a legendary either. Well, that was a shame. Quantum. Lunchbox. Could always use more of those. Hmm, excuse me. Yes, I don't know why, but... Ever since I've installed Sim Settlements, I've never been able to get a legendary spawn there. Ah, my true prize. Hey Teddy, appreciate you doing this. When the hub arrives, get it unpacked and connected ASAP. Don't forget to reposition the satellite, roughly between Serenitatis and Tranquilitatis. The hub will do the rest. Regards, Carl. Ah, my real prize. U.S. Covert Operations Manual. A boost to sneaking. And I'll take a mini mute. And in the chest, more ammo. Pre-war money. Definitely more pre-war money. Bag of cigarettes. Jump. Hey. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Huh. Would you look at that? Interesting. Very interesting. Why don't you tell me what's so interesting about this? Hmm? Oh, right. Take a look. Shipper label reads from Concord Hardware. This is definitely the equipment we're here for. No mistake there. This is the ACM comm hub. As best as I understand it, this thing connects to the sensors somehow, allowing them to do more stuff. But I wouldn't really know how it does that until I turn it on. Although looking at it, it doesn't look like time's been too kind to this old gal. I'm already seeing a fair number of damaged components. I wonder if it'll still be able to run. Can we fix this? I don't even know how bad the damage is yet. I'll have to take a closer look back at the hardware store. Well, I'd say we're done here. We found what we came for. No reason to stick around. You were a big help. There's no way I could have done this by myself. Can you explain how this thing is actually gonna work? Well, like I said, I won't really know until I can turn it on. I'm fairly familiar with ASAMs, but this is a new piece of technology for me. It's probably going to take a while to figure it out. It was a cakewalk. No problem at all. <laughs> I'd hate to see what you consider difficult. This was most definitely not a cakewalk. So now might be a good time to get your bearings. Still can't imagine how overwhelming all this must be for you. Like many a true neared, I already need a cup of tea. You've got going. Or if you think you might need more sensors, there may be some not too far from here. A place called West Everett Estates. But I should warn you, 
Area is overrun with super mutants. Might yes, a it's a silly place. We're not going to go there. After this. I'll think about it. Well, if you do decide to go, take care. I'll contact you once I've looked over the comm hub. Hopefully by then I should have some idea of how it works. Until then, stay safe out there, all right? Yes, Grant. Thank you. Yes. So West Everett Hills. They are, if I remember rightly... Wait. No, I can't get the marker out. Yes. It's right here. Castafington Boathouse is right here. But right to the north of it, 20 blood bugs. Alright, maybe it's more like 6. But it's still too many blood bugs. Every time I went there on a non-YOLO run, I've had to heal because they, those blood bugs would poison me and almost kill me. And I'm carrying too much because my sticky fingers. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of the blowtorch. It's not worth it. I do need to return the locket to Abernathy Farm. That should be the th my third settlement. If all goes according to plan. I hear thunder. Is it a rad store? Or is it just a regular store? I think it might just be a regular store. Okay. Head to Abernathy Farm. I'll bring you back when I get there. But hopefully, there's nothing scary along the way. Or sorry, unless there's something scary along the way. But hopefully there isn't. Because I have had Super Mutants spawn right on this bridge around here. It wasn't fun. But it looks like we're safe today. All right, I made it here. And, wouldn't you believe it, nothing exciting happened. I love it when nothing exciting happens. I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. I like how he just instantly stood up. Be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on her prices after what you've done. And feel free to use our workshop. At least we can. All right, I leveled up. Just gonna put a turret up here for Overwatcher. And. Only that turret. Okay. And I could have swore they had a water pump around here. I am missing one gear. All right, I searched and I searched, and I could not find a single gear anywhere. But I think that does it for today. And oh boy, today was very stressful. Anyway, thanks again for joining me on my playthrough through Fallout 4, You Only Love Once, with the Sim Settlements 2 mod. As always, I'm rooting for you. We're all in this together.